Hey everyone, uh, we're back. It's been a while since I've done a video, but um, I just had a new baby girl, and uh, yeah, things have been pretty busy, so uh, just getting back at it. Uh, just before I uh, wanted to get back into the Akula, I wanted to clean up everything and uh, get the coils kind of set up properly, so um, this may not be the way that I drive it ultimately, but um, right now it's just coming off the Tesla coil. There's no uh, uh, flip-flop push-pull driver or anything. Uh, I've just got the Tesla coil kind of resonator three-coil system, primary secondary here, resonator there, top load here, connected to this uh, aluminum plate as well as these air caps. Uh, so. And I can play with those. Just changing this little air cap. It's nothing as nice as an air cap. <laughs> and this resonator is set up on the output as well. Don't know if you can see that dim a little bit. Anyway, it did help it by a few volts putting that uh, output kind of resonator there. Um, and here, looks like this LED, which is a couple uh, forward-facing 1N148 uh, germanium diodes with uh, an LED. And for some reason, I'm really not sure why, but uh, it seemed to give uh, the amplitude that we're seeing here if I pulled off that LED, uh, which is just going from emitter to base, uh, essentially with those two diodes, um, it dims the lights and uh, uh, just lost a connection here. Just a moment. Okay, sorry about that. I just had a connection pop off of uh, that uh, coil there and burn the heck out of my finger. Um, so, yeah, the uh, ferrite was a definite need to have. Uh, so I've got it jammed in there pretty good, but uh, if you pull out the ferrite, uh, the light goes out. And I think that's got to do with the top load not being uh, enough area, surface area. Because um, on my uh, original uh, magnifying transmitter, over in the corner there, and uh, it's got, you know, a large top load, and I didn't need to have these caps, uh, all I had to do is balance the distance away from it, but in this case, uh, the top load is insufficient uh, for driving it this way, although, you know, we do have uh, roughly, just a sec here, Two volts. Uh, positive 92 and negative 112. And uh, about 255 kilohertz. That's what we're running at right now. And we've got the primary tuned as well. So we'll go down by 10 nanos. And up by one nano. And back down. So definitely tuning the primary with capacitance uh, seemed to help as well. Just a bit uh, squared off by the load. But if this was ringing just without uh, any light bulb, then you see nice round uh, peaks there. Um, so I just wanted to get the test the coil all tuned up before I added anything else. But um, yeah, I want to somehow incorporate uh, you know the Tesla's 
sole output to the light as well as having the push-pull driver uh, to the light as well at a third of the frequency of the Tesla coil and then get them phase locked in that uh, sequence so anyway I just wanted to say hello to everyone again and uh, things are back underway talk to you again